fuck I'm talking about oh, on, on Nas Irrelevant. How the fuck Nas irrelevant, homie? How the fuck Nas ain't relevant, homie? Niggas smoking dick, homie. I'm about to fucking, uh, Drake. Fuck, homie, niggas, bitch, be no fucking, did a fucking Drake. Nigga, what I'm saying? We salute Drake. We love Drake. Okay, whatever. Man, who smoking dick? Huh? What the fuck? I'm that Drake. Man, man, Nas is that nigga, homie. I know I can't. I know I can't be what I want to be. If I work hard at it, if I work hard at it, I'll be where I want to be. You crazy, boy. The fuck? Nas is that boy, homie. You tripping. Nas is that nigga, boy. You tripping, boy. The fuck? Nas invested in Nas invested in motherfucking um ring. You know what ring is, homie? The door along fucking doors, homie. Like alarms, boy. Nas I got that bag, boy. You tripping, boy? That nigga fucked up by Nas. I love that boy, homie. I ain't saying niggas ain't lit or whatever in they own the world, but like, boy, shit, the fuck out of me, cause nah, I wasn't bothering you, boy, I wasn't bothering you, nigga. It's Bryce Davis on the check-in. As y'all can see, call that black defendant Nas against 21 statement about being irrelevant on Clubhouse. I personally think Kodak Black trying to get that versus going, but anyway, uh, he has a point. Um, you know, if you listen to the audio, 21 Savage is basically asked about relevancy with artists, and I think he gave a real bad example. I think he would take it back if he could. As y'all saw on Twitter, he tweeted a statement saying he would never disrespect a legend like Nas who paved the way for him. And, you know, Nas's brother responded as well, calling him trash. But anyway, I'm going to cape for 21 in this situation because I just think he misspoke because, you know, he was giving his opinion on what makes an artist relevant. And he was basically saying, ain't no young art, I mean, young people like in their 20s copping new Nas. He was saying Nas has a cult fan base type shit. Like people that support Nas are, you know, still going to support him, but he ain't gaining no new traction or whatever. And, you know, I got to disagree with that making you relevant or irrelevant because Nas, he still has an impact on the culture. If y'all, you know, really think about it, King's Disease 3, you know, I listened to it last night. I actually think it's a pretty dope project. Definitely better than the last two. I personally like Magic better, you know, than the last two albums. But this one's definitely the best Nas album I heard in a long time. So, you know, if you got an opportunity, go check that out. And uh, if you feel otherwise, let me know in the comments. And, you know, if you like the video, of course, like and share. And I'm out.